It is what it is. After 25 years, we're still the fucking number one. Though. Nobody can touch us. Everybody else has tried and fucking failed. You know, after six seasons, it's like you become best friends with Tony. There's something special about it. <laughs> you know, The Rock was a massive fan of the show. The Rock would love how Tony would kick every single bitch's ass every week. The Rock loved that. You know, talk about a show that was you know, way ahead of its time. The show was absolutely marvelous. Wow. Uh, yeah, the show was very good. I liked it. I should have been on it, but... Uh. I look back and I watch that show, and I get jealous. Jealous at the fact that I wasn't on it. It was that fucking good. Hoo-ha! I had to say, it was a, it was a very good show. And you know what I loved about it? How addictive it was, you know what I mean? Tony Soprano, the big G, running the bada bing, yeah? <laughs> I know Tony Soprano was a G. Tony Soprano, you got Paulie as well, Christopher. Still, all the supporting characters, Carmela, they were all great. Except for fucking AJ. As each season went on, the more fucking infuriating and insufferable he became. All right? No fucking lies here. Yeah, wow. It's an incredible fucking show. That's, you know, lasted the test of time, and every rewatch gets even fucking better. Oh my god, wow, incredible. Let me give it to you fucking straight, okay? Everything else was fucking perfect, but don't fucking tell me that you enjoyed that ending. What the fuck was that all about? Blank, gone, finished. What the fuck? There would be no true detective if it weren't for the Sopranos. That's the truth. All right, all right, all right. Wow, amazing show. Probably the best ever. My only complaint, Artie Bucco. Fuck me, what an idiot sandwich. You know what I love about Tony? He was such a great character. And he would have been the biggest Trump supporter you've ever seen. Believe me when I say that. 